Not all prepping items have to be stuff that's expensive and only available on survival websites. A lot of the essential prepper items you need are cheap and you can go out and buy them at your local store right now. So let's go over some of them. First up is hand warmers. During the winter months, these will be a lifesaver. Activating a few hand warmers and keeping them in your pocket and inside your shirt can make a huge difference if you're outside in the cold. Petroleum jelly. A container of this will go for around $3. You can use it for dry skin. You can put it on a cotton ball and make a fire starter. You can use it for wound care and so much more. I did a whole video on petroleum jelly and its survival and prepping uses if you want to go and check it out. Disposable gloves. These will be very important for cleaning because we'll be disposing of garbage and waste on our own and we don't want anything getting on our hands. You also don't want any harsh chemicals getting on your hands when you're cleaning your home. You're going to be going through a lot of these, probably at least one pair a day, so you need to get many boxes of them. If your phone and your GPS stop working, you will have to go back to basics. When it comes to navigation, a compass with a map is the best option for that. I bought this one for $3. But you can get small button compasses as well, which will probably only cost you less than a dollar each. Mini button lights. These will cost you maybe a dollar each, but they're really good as a backup to your main flashlight. You can keep one on your keys, in your pocket, and in your survival kits. They may not seem very bright, but at night if you're looking through your backpack or something up close, they do give off enough light. Another quick tip is if you're walking at night through a forest or something with your family, you can turn the light on and tie it to your pet's collar or a family member's backpack. So if they're walking in front of you and go too far away, you can still see them and they won't get lost. Tin foil. This can be used for many things like cooking food. You can make a plate out of it. You can make a pot to boil water. You can use the shiny side for signaling and so much more. Tin foil is inexpensive and reusable, so every prepper should have a few rolls for emergencies. Safety pins. You can use these for repairing clothing or bags. You can cut and shape it into a fishing hook. You can use them to make a lock pick. You can use them to remove splinters and ticks. You can use it to hold an emergency bandage wrap. And there are many other uses. They're so small that you can keep a bunch of these in your bug out bag and they barely take up any space. Plastic and paper cups, bowls, and utensils. So the reason you should have these is because with regular plates and utensils, you'll have to wash them. And if you have a very limited supply of water, then you don't want to use it on washing. You want to save it for drinking. The next item is dish soap. Now, if you do have a continuous supply of water, like a nearby river or a well, then you don't have to worry about running out of water. Keep lots of dish soap so that you can properly keep your plates and cups clean. You can use just water, but it's never clean enough if that's all you're using. Dish soap is the best way to get all the bacteria out. Baby wipes. These can be used for cleaning your baby and cleaning yourself if you can't get a shower or simply don't want to waste water. You can also use them for general cleaning around your home if that's all you have. What are some other inexpensive prepping items that you can buy at your local store? Let me know in the comments. All right, guys, that's all for today's video. Thanks for watching.